Hey, welcome back to the channel. Hey, if this is your first time here and you're looking to sharpen your plumbing skills or maybe get some ideas and home improvement tips when it comes to improvement on your plumbing system, then consider dropping down below and hitting the subscribe button. Don't forget to ring the bell icon. That way you're not going to miss any of my awesome videos. Let's get right to it. Okay, so today I'm going to bring you a product review on something that is being used today on the market to install into your sewer system to try to keep unwanted critters from entering your home. Now everybody knows the sewer system is a nasty place, but a lot of people and homeowners don't know that they may have rats that are running around in their sewer line and the possibility that they can come up through some sort of a drain and enter your home. Next thing you know, you got a rodent in the house. Okay, so here we go. Uh, what this is, this is a product made by the Jones Stevens Corporation. All right, this is an inline T, has a cap that comes off of here. We set that aside, as you can see inside of there. Look at this. This has got a flap that opens and closes. Now, this product is made out of scheduled 40 PVC. All right, this is usually generally put in in line on your outside sewer line system. Okay, when you flush the toilet, water, and business is going to come through here. All right, and that flap that's inside of there that I showed you is going to allow it to open up and let the stuff head out to the city sewer. Okay, so in theory, the way this thing works is we have our sewer pipe. This is actually a scheduled 3034 pipe. We've got our little rodent rat. And wants to take and come into your home through your sewer line. So he comes walking up through here, walking up through here, because he just came from the nasty sewer. And all of a sudden, bang, he hits his flap and he can't get in there any further. All right, that's what the whole design of this product is about. Okay, so now comes the pros and the cons to this product. So the first thing I kind of like about this product is the fact that it is serviceable. Okay, with a cap that I showed you that sits on top of here. You can actually take this thing on and off and service if you end up getting some sort of a stoppage in here or uh, your flap inside ends up wearing out and breaking. It's also made out of heavy duty constructed uh, scheduled 40 PVC so it's made to last a long time. So here's what I don't like about this product. First of all this flap unless you make some sort of uh, adjustments or upgrades can easily pop off just like that it's not designed very well to stay in there okay so you get some sort of a critter that is nudging his head up against inside of here and stuff um, he may end up knocking that thing loose and still making his way into your home now if you look closely this thing just kind of sits in a slot like that so it's easy to come in and out which tells me that this product could end up failing and falling and when you flush you're going to end up getting some sort of stoppage there so I'm going to show you a quick little solution that could take care of that problem where that flap's not going to come off on you now what I've done is I've taken a regular little zip tie and I've cut a small little piece what I want to try to do is get that piece up there on that lip like that and then take a couple small screws, put one there and put one there and fasten them right to the housing and keeping that little piece of zip tie there. That way when this thing opens, it's got nowhere to go. It's not going to fall. It's a quick, easy solution. It only takes a couple minutes. If you do it right, this thing won't end up come falling down down here and next thing you know, you got a stoppage. All right, so one other thing that I noticed about this particular product that I wasn't really crazy about is the fact being that it has a removable cap like this. Now in here it says hand tighten only. All right, so as you tighten that thing down, cool, you have access to get in here. But what happens is you may end up getting roots that find their way in here. Now, this company has designed this cap where it has a rubber seal and gasket around inside of there, which is their way of trying to keep the roots from getting inside of this product. Without any kind of hesitation, I'm going to tell you right now that you're going to need to get a licensed plumber to come out and do this if you think that you're having that sort of problem inside your home. So there you have it. A uh, quick product review on uh, some solutions on trying to keep rodents, and rats, and stuff like that out of your home. Uh, not everybody is going to experience the same kind of success. Make sure to always get yourself a local licensed plumber. And uh, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to subscribe down below. Have yourself a great weekend, and don't forget to keep plumbing. Thank you so much for watching my video. Until next time, this has been Plumbing with Tim. Keep plumbing.